They wouldn't let me see this next one ahead of time since they said I'd spoil it. It must be good. Let's find out. Insects are mesmerizing with fascinating body plans, textures, and colors. But there are way too many to count. Seriously, for every human on the planet, there are over one billion insects, which is why we're gonna take a little moment for some insect appreciation. Hi, I'm Esther. I think nature is awesome, and I wanna tell you about it. So we're gonna learn about some of my favorite beautiful bugs on today's Nature Side Quest. First up, the Buprestidae beetle, AKA the jewel-toned beetle. These metallic wood-boring beetles have glossy iridescent colors, which means that their colors can change based on the angle you're viewing them from. Look at this thing. Instead of their bodies absorbing most wavelengths of white light and then reflecting back only one specific color, like many other things we look at, their exoskeletons trap and diffract all wavelengths of light and send off different colors in various directions. Recent research suggests that these cool colors might confuse potential predators, like birds. So these beetles aren't actually using their shininess to hide. They're using it so they don't even look like bugs. Next up, the Sphinx caterpillar. I love caterpillars because they come in such bright colors. I mean, this looks like a school bus with a bunch of eyes looking out of the windows. Right? Just me? Okay. I don't know what occasion this guy's dressed for, but I kind of like it. But these caterpillars don't actually turn into butterflies. They become moths. Really, really big moths. Hawk moths are huge. Their wingspans can be up to eight inches long. And some species of hawk moths have the longest tongue in the insect world, up to 12 inches long, which is pretty ridiculous. Unlike butterflies and bees, hawk moths don't pollinate food crops. Instead, they pollinate flowers, like the poisonous Deuterostronomium. And when you think about it, keeping a dangerous meal plan is probably a great way to ensure that you always have plenty to eat. Honestly, you guys, there are so many cool insects to talk about that we didn't even scratch the surface. But that's okay, because it means that you can go look them up for yourself. That's all for now. I'll see you on our next Nature Side Quest. If you're watching this, you must have really liked the video. Make sure you follow and subscribe and check out these other videos that are even better. No, really. I've seen this one over a hundred times.